Arabic and its different dialects are spoken by around 422 million speakers native and non-native in the Arab world as well as in the Arab diaspora making it one of the five most spoken languages in the world. Currently, 22 countries are member states of the Arab League as well as five countries were granted an observer status which was founded in Cairo in 1945. Arabic is classified as a macrolanguage comprising 30 modern varieties, including its standard form. Arabic is the lingua franca of people who live in countries of the Arab world as well as of Arabs who live in the diaspora, particularly in Latin America especially Brazil and Argentina or Western Europe like France, Spain, Germany or Italy. Cypriot Arabic is an recognized minority language in the EU member state Cyprus and is the only European variety of Arabic within the Arabic macrolanguage. Maltese is the only fully separate standardized language to have originated from an Arabic dialect, the extinct Sicilian Arabic dialect, with independent literary norms. It has its own language code, milliliter per milliliter, that is distinct from that used for the Arabic macrolanguage, R era, and has no diglossic relationship with standard Arabic or classical Arabic. It is one of the official languages of the EU. Topic: <laughs> Countries with Arabic as an official language. Topic. As of 2018, there are 25 independent nations where Arabic is an official language. The following is a list of sovereign states and territories where Arabic is an official or de facto official language. Topic. Countries with Arabic as a national language or a recognized minority language Topic. As of 2016, there are six independent nations where Arabic is a national language or a recognized minority language, but not primary language. The following is a list of sovereign states and territories where Arabic is a national language or a recognized minority language. Cyprus Cypriot Arabic alongside Armenian is one of the two recognized minority languages of Cyprus, since 2008. It is spoken by the Maronite community, which is a minority in Cyprus especially in the cities Nicosia, Limassol and Larnaca. Cypriot Arabic also known as Cypriot Maronite Arabic is taught at the elementary school of St. Maron, which is located in Anthopolis southern of Nicosia, Cyprus. Iran. Topic. Arabic is a recognized minority language of Iran. In addition, the constitution recognizes the Arabic language as the language of Islam, giving it a formal status as the language of religion, and regulates its spreading within the Iranian national curriculum. After the Islamic Revolution in 1979, Arabic as the language of Quran became mandatory for pupils in Iran. Arabic courses are mandatory starting from 6th year of schooling, first year of middle school until the 11th year, penultimate year of high school. The local dialects of Arabic spoken by Arab minorities in Iran, like Awazi Arabs, Kamsa Arabs, Marsh Arabs as well as Arabs in Khorasan, are Khuzestani Arabic and Mesopotamian Arabic, also known as Iraqi Arabic, mainly in Khuzestan province as well as Khorasani Arabic especially in Khorasan province. There are several TV channels in Arabic language broadcasting from Iran, namely, Al Alam, Al Qadir TV, as well as iFilm. Currently, the sole newspaper in Arabic language published in Iran is Kayan Al Arabi out of 23 Persian dailies and three English dailies newspapers in Iran. In 2008, the public university Payame Noor University declared that Arabic will be the second language of the university, and that all its services will be offered in Arabic, concurrent with Persian. Mali Arabic is one of the recognized national languages in Mali. Hassania Arabic, a variety of Maghrebi Arabic is spoken by a minority in Mali especially by the Azawa Arabs also known as nomadic Moors nomadic ethnic Arab ancestry tribes who are settling mainly in the area of Azawa which is a dry basin covering what is today northwestern Niger, as well as parts of northeastern Mali and southern Algeria. Niger Arabic is one of the recognized national languages in Niger. 
Arabic is spoken by a minority in Niger especially by the Diffa Arabs also known as Mahamid Arabs an Arab nomadic tribespeople who is living in eastern Niger, mostly in the Diffa region. <inaudible> Senegal Arabic is one of the recognized national languages in Senegal. Hassania Arabic is spoken by a minority in Senegal. Turkey There is an Arab minority in Turkey who speak Arabic as their native language. Therefore, Arabic is a recognized minority language in Turkey. Historically Arabic was the official language in the territory which form nowadays the state of Turkey during the time when this region was a part of the Umayyad Caliphate between 661 and 750 and later when it belonged to the Abbasid Caliphate the national public broadcaster of Turkey the Turkish Radio and Television Corporation also known as TRT broadcasts TRT Al Arabiya a 24 hours a day TV channel in Arabic language launched in April 2010. In 2015, the Turkey's Ministry of Education announced that as of the 2016-17 academic year, Arabic language courses as a second language will be offered to students in elementary school starting in second grade. The Arabic courses will be offered as an elective language course like German, French and English which are already being offered to elementary school students for a long time. According to a prepared curriculum, second and third graders will start learning the Arabic language by listening comprehension and speaking, while introduction to writing will join these skills in fourth grade and after fifth grade students will start learning the language in all its four basic skills. Countries where Arabic has a special status according to the constitution As of 2018, there are four independent countries where Arabic has a special status according to the constitution. The following is a list of sovereign states and territories where Arabic has a special status according to the constitution. Iran. The Constitution of the Islamic Republic of Iran recognizes the Arabic language as the language of Islam, giving it a formal status as the language of religion, and regulates its spreading within the Iranian national curriculum. The Constitution declares in Chapter 2, the official language, script, calendar, and flag of the country in Article 16. Since the language of the Qur and an Islamic texts and teachings is Arabic, it must be taught after elementary level, in all classes of secondary school and in all areas of study. Israel Historically Arabic was the official language in the territory which form nowadays the State of Israel for around 1,382 years from 636 until 2018. The Knesset cancelled Arabic as an official language and gave Arabic a special status of the country Israel by adopting the relevant basic law. The basic law, Israel is the nation state of the Jewish people an Israeli basic law which specifies the nature of the state of Israel as the nation state of the Jewish people states in number 4 b that the Arabic language has a special status in the state, regulating the use of Arabic in state institutions or by them will be set in law. The law declares in number 4 c, this clause does not harm the status given to the Arabic language before this law came into effect. Quote, the law was adopted by the Knesset 62 in favor, 55 against and 2 abstentions on 19 July 2018. Arabic is an indigenous language in the territory which form nowadays the state of Israel and which is still the lingua franca of Arab citizens of Israel as well as of Arab foreigners especially Palestinians who have only a Palestinian Authority passport which is not recognized of many countries as these countries don backquote t recognize the state of Palestine why these Palestinians are seen as statelessness of many countries. In addition, Arabic is spoken of Arab Jews in Israel who immigrated from different Arab countries to Israel as Aliyah and got the Israeli citizenship according to the Israeli Nationality Law of 1952. <laughs> Pakistan 
Historically Arabic was the official language in the territory which form nowadays the State Islamic Republic of Pakistan during the time when this region was a part of the Umayyad Caliphate between 651 and 750. According to the Constitution of Pakistan of 1956 the two languages Urdu which is very close to Hindi, both also called Hindustani language which were two of the lingua franca of North India and Pakistan that time as well as Bengali at that time the lingua franca in the territory which is today the independent state Bangladesh became the national languages in the new founded state Islamic Republic of Pakistan. General Ayub Khan the second president of Pakistan advocated the institution of Arabic language teaching as part of national planning. Ayub's educational plan emphasized Urdu and English as the primary language of Pakistan, but additionally recommended that Arabic be a secondary language of instruction along with English. The Arabic language is mentioned in the Constitution of Pakistan. It declares in Article 31 No. 2 that the state shall endeavor, as respects the Muslims of Pakistan, a to make the teaching of the Holy Quran and Islamiyat compulsory, to encourage and facilitate the learning of Arabic language. There is also an Arab minority in Pakistan. In addition, a remarkable number of Pakistanis are able to speak Arabic as they were living in the rich GCC countries for working reasons in Saudi Arabia around 1.5 million, in UAE around 1.2 million, in Qatar around 150,000, in Kuwait around 130,000, in Oman around 85,000, in Bahrain around 80,000 for a very long time. These overseas Pakistanis who are living in countries of the Arab world are also named Arab Pakistanis or Pakistani Arabs. The National Education Policy 2017 declares in Article 3.7.4 that, Arabic as compulsory part will be integrated in Islamia from middle to higher secondary level to enable the students to understand the Holy Quran. Furthermore, it specifies in Article 3.7.6, Arabic as elective subject shall be offered properly at secondary and higher secondary level with Arabic literature and grammar in its course to enable the learners to have command in the language. This law is also valid for private schools as it defines in Article 3.7.12, the curriculum in Islamia, Arabic and moral education of public sector will be adopted by the private institutions to make uniformity in the society. Topic. Philippines Topic. The Arabic language is mentioned in the Philippine Constitution of 1986. It specifies that, "...Spanish and Arabic shall be promoted on a voluntary and optional basis." Arabic is mainly used by some Filipino Muslims in both a liturgical and instructional capacity since the arrival of Islam and establishment of several sultanates like Sultanate of Maguindano, Sultanate of Sulu and Sultanate of Rana in the present-day state Philippines. Along with Malay, Arabic was the lingua franca of the Malay archipelago among Muslim traders and the Malay aristocracy in the history. Arabic is taught for free and is promoted in some Islamic centers predominantly in the southernmost parts of Philippines. Non-sovereign entities where Arabic is an official language as of 2016, there are nine non-sovereign entities where Arabic is an official language. The following is a list of non-sovereign entities and autonomous regions as well as territories where Arabic is an official or de facto official language. History Umayyad Caliphate Topic. The early Muslim conquests Arabic, al 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 and the following expansion of Islam Arabic, Anshar al Intishar al-Islam led to the expansion of the Arabic language in northern Africa, the Iberian Peninsula, the Caucasus, Western Asia, Central Asia and South Asia. Along with the religion of Islam, the Arabic language, Arabic number system and Arab customs spread throughout the entire Arab Caliphate. The caliphs of the Arab dynasty established the first schools inside the empire which taught Arabic language and Islamic studies for all pupils in all areas within the caliphate. The result was in those areas which belonged to the Arab empire the creation of the society that was mostly Arabic speaking because of the assimilation of native inhabitants. 
During the period of the Umayyad Caliphate 661 the fifth Umayyad Caliph Abd al-Malik established Arabic instead of the local languages as the sole official state language of government across the entire caliphate. Abbasid Caliphate while the Abbasid Caliphate originally gained power by exploiting the social inequalities against non-Arabs in the Umayyad Empire, during Abbasid rule the empire rapidly was Arabized. As knowledge was shared in the Arabic language throughout the empire, people of different nationalities and religions began gradually to speak Arabic in their everyday lives. Resources from other languages began to be translated into Arabic, and a unique Islamic identity began to form that fused previous cultures with Arab culture, creating a level of civilization and knowledge that was considered a marvel in Europe and the Western world. Fatimid Caliphate the Arabic language remained the lingua franca of high culture under the Fatimids 909 Spanish Umayyads in the Iberian Peninsula, and later Muslim dynasties in North Africa and Spain and of the Mamluks in Egypt and Syria-Palestine. Al-Andalus in the history, Andalusian Arabic was the official language in Spain and Portugal, formerly Al-Andalus for more than 700 years until the fall of the last Islamic state in Iberia at Granada in 1492. Italy and Malta Siculo Arabic or Sicilian Arabic was a spoken language on the islands of Sicily and neighboring Malta at that time Emirate of Sicily 831-1091 between the end of the 9th century and the end of the 12th century. Topic: <laughs> Greece. Topic: Furthermore, a form of Arabic was spoken on the Mediterranean island of Crete in those days Emirate of Crete from the late 820s c. 824 or 827 828 until the Byzantine reconquest in 961 topic <inaudible> south sudan topic Arabic alongside English was an official language in South Sudan from 1863 these days a part of Egypt islet 1517 to 1867 until 2011 that time the independent state republic of South Sudan when the former government cancelled Arabic as an official language since 2011 English is the sole official language of South Sudan the Arabic dialect Juba Arabic is still the lingua franca of the people in South Sudan The Gambia In 2014, Gambian President Yahya Jama announced that the Gambia would drop English as the official language because it is a colonial relic. He replaced Gambia's official language English with Arabic in 2014. However, such change was not enacted. Israel Topic. Historically Arabic was the official language in the territory which form nowadays the State of Israel for around 1,382 years. The Arabic language was spread with the Muslim conquest of the Levant which took place between 634 and 638 and became the official language in the territory of Jun Falastin which was a part of the Rashidun Caliphate at that time. Arabic remained as the official language in this area during the time of different Muslim dynasties which control this territory for several centuries, namely Umayyad Caliphate, Abbasid Caliphate, Mamluk Sultanate, Damascus Islet, an islet of the Ottoman Empire, Syria Vilayet, a first-level administrative division Vilayet of the Ottoman Empire, Mutasarifate of Jerusalem, an Ottoman district with special administrative status, as well as during the time when this territory came under the control of the British Empire, known as Occupied Enemy. Territory Administration and the following geopolitical entity Mandatory Palestine. 
The Arabic language alongside Hebrew also remained as an official language in the State of Israel for the first 70 years after the proclamation in 1948 until 2018. The Knesset cancelled the status of Arabic as an official language by adopting the relevant basic law, Israel as the nation state of the Jewish people on 19 July 2018. This Israeli basic law states in number 4 a that the state's language is Hebrew. Topic. Territories where Arabic was an official or de facto official language and later replaced or repealed. There were several territories which later became independent states where Arabic was an official or de facto official language and where it has been replaced by other languages or repealed. The following is a list of territories which later became independent states where Arabic was an official or de facto official language in the history. See also Arabic Modern Standard Arabic Arab League Arab World Topic References Topic Official Languages by Country Bibliography Topic Notes Topic Arab immigrants in Latin American politics Descendants of Arabs thriving in S. America. Arab roots grow deep in Brazil's rich melting pot. The Washington Times. External links List of countries where Arab is official language with pictures and flags.